Okay, go for it. Okay. All right. So, okay. Thanks, Joanna, for your sweet words. Uh, do not deserve them. <laughs> um, so I'm going to share my screen because I did create a, just a quick presentation so I can stay on track because my mind is kind of all over the place. Oh, it's disabled because I'm just a participant. Can you make me a host real quick? Is that possible? Okay. Awesome. All right. Um, let's see. Okay. All right. So I'm assuming, can everyone see that? Okay. Awesome. So yeah, as Joanna said, um, I shared this with her on a call we had. Um, so I got this idea from Ashley Swingle. I cannot take full credit. I kind of took it and then did, did my own thing with it. But she, so she shared with me that she does a customer care chat. So, um, it's just, I have like, I think I have like 32 or 36 people and it was just like a lot messaging people individually. So I just put them all in one chat like she does. And, um, so every Friday she would do like a freebie, like a giveaway and just do like a quick little prize um, and have something for them to read or do to get the prize. So um, these are some ideas of like things that I have my customers do in order to be entered to win the prize for that week. Um, so my, I try to get them to either like learn about a new product or learn about sharing. And that's the main thing that I focus on, but I do get some complaints from people on that. So I try to spread it out. So, but I like always talk about sharing your referral link and I share, you know, the, the um, bonuses for that month and that kind of like a lot of people don't realize that. And some people will message me individually and be like, okay, how can I share? And I'm, I, it's happened with some people that I never would have thought would be interested in sharing. So it's like, you never really know, like you genuinely don't. Um, so, but like taking a selfie with your pink drink, voting in a poll. Um, so what I usually have them do is I have them read through like announcements, like just quick little things. Um, and then I say like this message once you read it and then vote in the poll below or like perform the task um, to be entered to win. I don't, sometimes I give like a timeline. If it's like a quick thing, I'm like, do it by the end of the day. If it's like more involved, then I'm like, you know, you have through the weekend or whatever. Um, so in the, like for this week, um, to give an example, I'm doing an event on Thursday um, because of the double um, business builder bonuses. Um, and also a lot of people don't realize that, you know, they can get paid like right away, like within, you know, a few days of sharing. So, um, I had them read through that. Um, and then basically I created a poll, like, um, I'm interested in coming to the event, but I just want to sit in and pay it like, like sit in as a guest this time and not invite. And then the other two are, I have a ton of people I want to invite help me with verbiage. And I had a lot of people vote on that one. Um, and then, or I have a few people I want to invite, but I don't, I don't need any help. Like I'm good. So um, I kind of, I don't give them an option to say completely no. Um, and then once they vote, then they get entered. Um, and then I also did scheduling a VIP chat with me. So I, on Calendly, I created like separate um, things that like links that they can schedule calls. And one of them is a VIP chat. It's 15 minutes. And Ashley gave me the tip of saying chat instead of call because a chat is a lot less intimidating. And I have some people who hate being on phone calls. And shockingly enough, they scheduled chats with me. So I got to talk to, and it was exhausting, but it was worth it. Um, I got to talk to, I think, eight of them, um, eight or 10. And I still have a few that are scheduled. But basically, if they scheduled a chat with me and held it, then they got entered to win a $20 Amazon gift card. I was feeling extra generous because I felt like that's a bigger one. Um, but from those calls, three of them shared with me that they have people they want to share their referral link with. So um, they're inviting to the event on Thursday. Um, and then like the video, if I come across a video that I'm like, this would be great for them to watch, um, I send that to um, and if it's a longer one, then again, I'll make the prize a little bit more um, 
And, and then one time I had them go in and share how many perks points they had. And I had them watch a video on perks points because like it, some people don't read through my email, like my welcome email. And, um, so that has been really helpful too. And then sharing the date of their subscription, like share which date your sub is going to run. Um, so that like one, they know, and they're not surprised because that happens a lot. And then two, um, it helps me to see like, okay, who's definitely, you know, going to let their subscription run. Um, oops. Okay. And then, so these are just some prize ideas. So what I do, um, like on mother's day, this was actually how I did it around mother's day. Amazon came up with like gift ideas, like five and under 10 and under, um, for mother's day. And I just went on those, um, lists and I created my own Plexus giveaways list. And so I'll just, um, as soon as like I see it, like if I'm scrolling to, and I'm like, that would be a good prize, then I'll just add it to that list and then ship it directly to the person. So you're not paying shipping or anything like that. Um, occasionally I will give away some Plexus things. Um, and then that's, you know, something that obviously I have to ship. Um, and then I, last week I did my bone broth, like the bone broth that I drink every morning. Um, and, people like ask me about it. So that was the prize. These are just some ideas. Um, but these are just like other thoughts that I had around it as it's just a great way to keep people engaged and like everyone loves it. And I have some ladies who share, um, like their progress and like different exciting, like milestones. And it's helpful for people who are on the earlier end too, um, and we're in the detox phase and are suffering. So, um, and then, yeah, it's just, it helps keep retention and helps them learn. Um, but yeah, and this is how I've added like level twos and beyond is through this like group chat and then doing the freebie Fridays, like every Friday. So yeah, that's pretty much all that I have. So good. Like so smart so simple and really fun. Like, I love all of it. I have a question. Um, yeah. can you walk us through how you add people to your customer care chat? Like they sign up and then what? Um, so basically, so they sign up, I send them an email and in that email, um, I have like a ton of stuff. It's a very packed email. And I always tell them the more you read in the email, the better off you'll be. Um, and cause for a while people weren't, I could tell they weren't reading it cause they would ask me questions that I address in the email. So, um, I would refer them to the email and then obviously answer the question. But so I start with that and then I let them know like, Hey, I do a giveaway every Friday. Um, so I'm going to add you to this group chat. And I've had a few people leave like people who don't like to get a bunch of notifications. And I do tell them like, if you get bothered by notifications, just mute it and then just come to it when you can. Um, just check on Friday mornings. So um, yeah, but that's, I just let them know, like, I'm going to add you. I don't really ask. Um, and then if they want to leave, they can, but most of them stay. So yeah. I love that so much. And then do you, when, once you add them, do you like welcome them at all or anything in your chat or no? Yes, I do. I do a welcome. And I just started this. I wish I had done it sooner because I think um, the person that I just added felt like weird about the way I did it, but I I'm going to do this from now on. Um, I welcomed her and I shared like what she's starting with. Um, and so, yeah. And then, but she's starting with something different that no one else has ordered. Um, cause I started everyone with the triplex. She's my first person to order just the meta burn. Um, <clears throat> and I haven't tried it. Nobody else has tried it. So she was sharing about it. And then like a bunch of people were like, Oh, I want to try that. I'm going to add that to my next order. So, yeah. So genius. That yeah. is genius. I love that. So it's coming um, from oh, someone else, not from me. So yeah, it's better. Like, yeah. So <laughs> much better. Like third party validation. So smart. Yeah. Um, does anyone have any questions? Kayla, is that okay? If anyone yeah. asks a question, I see a lot of people in the chat, just loving that idea. So I yeah. have a question. I don't know. Yeah, Sorry. Go for it. Go for um, it. what do you name your chat? Like, is it named custom and customer care? Um, I think Ashley's is mine is, uh, Kayla's healing club. Like I'm just, cause that's why focus is helping. Like, mm -hmm. 
which I know we're all doing that, but like, that's right. how I talk to people. And that's like my whole okay. Instagram. So yeah, that's what it's named. Mm -hmm. Right. I think there's um, even I have a question too. Yeah, um, when you add, like, do you do the same thing every time you sign someone? Because like, I know there's sometimes they can get lost in the chat, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. So like, I didn't know if you sent like, like the customer care videos, for example. Is that so, like part of it? Or is that like part of your email? That's part of my email. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That was mm -hmm. question. yeah. I try to keep it to a minimum, like my messages. So we okay. all want your email now. If, if do you mind sharing like a screenshot of what your email looks like? Oh yeah. I, so yeah. I created it on, um, Oh, I can't remember what it's called. It's like some fancy email thing yeah, that you have to pay I've for. Done like that, yeah. Yeah. And I don't want to pay for it anymore. So, but I I I created it and I just forward it and just remove all the tags. Um, but um let me see. Yeah, I can I can take a screenshot of it. It's just been a while, actually. Yeah. I have a few to send out now. So it's actually kind of long. So I'll actually screen record it because the screen, uh, so yeah, screenshot won't do it justice. Okay. It. <laughs> so, yeah. So I include the video first and then I include like all like their ID, their login, their, their referral link, and then save the image to your phone, like the triplex system, and then what to expect over the next 90 days. Like I think you shared it, Joanna, like the first 30, 60, and 90. Um, and then helpful tips to see results sooner. Um, and then basically I'm your biggest cheerleader. Um, and then my prayer for them. So thank you. Anyone have any other questions? Um, I do. I just don't know how to do the wheel of names. I've seen other people do it, but I'm just curious how you do that. Yeah, it's free. So if you Google wheel, I think it's wheel of names. Uh, yeah, wheel of names. It's I think it's wheel of names .com, Um, and you literally just like type in each name on a single line, and it adds it to the wheel, and you'll see it. It'll do it automatically. Um, and then what I'll do is I will screen record, and once soon as I hit like spin and then it'll pop it'll spin and then stop on the name and then pop up with the name and I just stop recording and then I send it there yeah exactly very cool thank you yeah super fun all right and I have a question I do um so because you have your customer care chat do you send personal messages to your customers at all ever yeah or? Okay. I do yeah I still do I I try to keep like that one to just like basic things and and then I still I still am very like personal with my customers yeah okay okay well thank you so much Kayla yeah I'm excited to do something similar um okay you all so tonight is our last night for the book study if you're in that we're gonna oh wait hang on let me stop 